In this video, I'm going to show students how to take a photo on their Chromebook and then upload it into a Google Classroom assignment. And the first step is to take the photo with your Chromebook. So to open the camera, I'm going to come over to this circle menu on my Chromebook. And when I click that, I can tap into this search bar and type the word camera. And you can see the camera app is there. I just click on that to open it. And now I can see my camera. Um, I'll give you a couple of tips before you start to take your picture. Um, first, I like to send this into full screen mode by clicking on this icon. And this way I can just see everything a little bit more clearly. And the other thing I like to do is before I start trying to place my paper, I like to move the cursor over on top of this button. Um, and that's the button I have to click in order to take the photo. And if it's there already, I can just kind of reach down and tap um, the trackpad so that I can take the photo without messing too much with the computer. So, uh, so I have my paper. Um, another suggestion that I would make is if you, if you have the, the choice, I would work on your paper sideways, if you have the choice. I know sometimes it's not an option, um, but if you can, you can just see how the paper fits much better this way than it does this way. You can also see me kind of sneaking around the paper so that I can see the screen, so I can see how this is looking on the screen. So now it's, it's just really a matter of holding this paper in just the right position so that I can take a good picture of it. So I haven't filled this whole paper, so I'm going to come way up and I'm going to try to turn it just right. By now you've noticed that everything on the screen shows up backwards. Don't be nervous. When we take the picture, that's not going to happen. Um, so now that I have it nice and close, I have my lighting in the room really good. Um, I've even kind of angled my screen so that it's getting the best light that it can. And so now I'm going to sneak one hand down to the trackpad and touch the trackpad. And now I've taken my photo. Um, like I said, you want to get as much light as you can on that paper. Um, you can even kind of bring a, go over to a desk lamp so that there's some light coming in from the side right at your paper. That'll make it um, even brighter and even easier for your teacher to read. So I've taken the photo. Um, if I want to check to make sure that the photo actually looks good, um, sometimes at the last second, you might move your hand and it'll be blurry. So I can come down just like on a phone. If you've ever done this on a phone, there's a little circle there with the picture in it. I can touch that and open up the picture. And you can see, like I told you, it's not actually backwards. Um, but I just want to take a look at this and make sure it's not blurry. This isn't an amazing photo, but I think my teacher is going to be able to read it. So I'm going to stop and click out the X. I can now close my camera. And now I'm ready to upload that photo into my assignment. So here's one of my assignments. Um, I'm going to come up to the Add or Create button. And I want to upload a file, that picture file is on my Chromebook. Um, so I need to upload it. I'm going to go to Upload. And then I have to browse to find my file. And you can see um, one way to check that you're finding the right file is you can see on my Chromebook that it is 140. And here's a picture that I took at 139. That's the one. I don't want the one from 131. That one's terrible. Um, so I'm going to click on that file and come down to click Open. And now I have that image inside my assignment. And when I'm ready, if that's the only thing I have to do, I can go ahead and click Turn In and then Confirm. And now that photo has been submitted to the teacher, um, and I took it on my Chromebook. Of course, you can use this not just to take pictures of paper, um, but also of anything that, that you might be given as an assignment. Good luck.